Good afternoon and welcome. We are coming to you from day two of the Fiji Symposium in Bangalore, the platform for all dialogue on financial inclusion. And with me today is Secretary Telecom and Chairman of Telecom Commission, Mrs. Aruna Sundarajan. Welcome, ma'am, and thank you for being part of the Fiji Symposium. Thank this you. this is the first Fiji Symposium and it's happening in India. Your thoughts on this? First of all, I think it's very appropriate that India is hosting the first uh, global event on financial inclusion. Because as you know, India has indeed been one of the prime movers in this space. And most of the action is actually happening here. Uh, and this is happening uh, at three levels. First of all, in terms of you know, the Digital India program, uh, the government's push to ensure that there's access, there's identity, and there's inclusion. So that's what the jam trinity, the Jandan, Aadhaar, Mobile is all about. And if you see over the last one year or so, there has been so much happening in this space uh, because you know the Prime Minister launched the UPI Beam a platform, which today makes it possible for anybody to transact using a mobile smartphone, a feature phone, or even just his plain thumb. Uh, so the platform is there. Then the way in which the payment infrastructure has uh, increased in the country, we've seen a five to ten fold increase in the payment infrastructure that's happened in this uh, last few months. And thirdly, an exciting array of new products are coming up. So today I think India is one of those countries where you can actually open an account online, you can get your credit profile, you can get specialized access to products online. So it's a very exciting space and I think that's why it's, it's, it's really good that this is happening here. And uh, what is the role of the Telecom Commission and what are the next steps in the future for to actually increase digital financial services in India? See, first of all, all of the digital uh, platforms need underlying telecom infrastructure to ride on. So that is the mandate of the Telecom Commission and that's what we're working on. One, we need to get access to everybody out there, 1.2 billion Indians. Secondly, we want to ensure that internet is accessible to everybody. And so the Telecom Commission and the Telecom Department are working, one, on creating the infrastructure for this rollout. We have this very ambitious Bharat Net program where we're trying to put optic fiber uh, connectivity in all the gram panchayats. But we're also working on things like creating security and trust frameworks. You know, if somebody uses a mobile phone, he needs to feel that the network is safe. He needs to feel that the device that he's using is secure. So we're working on that. We're also working on other issues like, uh, you know, trying to create a central equipment identity register so that you don't have somebody duplicating your SIM. Uh, or your mobile. So a lot of work is going on on the telecom side because that is the basic platform on which the rest of it will have to be layered. And that's the only way financial inclusion can actually, can actually happen. Thank you so much ma'am. Thank you so much for your time.